Hello, everybody. Welcome back. More auto chess. More, uh, you know, finds an excuse to play more auto chess. <laughs> Let's go. What are we gonna... Oh, should we learn and not go... Not go mech? We'll see. I mean, the first turn doesn't really matter that much. I mean, there's a couple people. There's a mech. There's goblin. Goblin. Mech. Okay. So I think we made a good choice so far by uh, avoiding it, at the very least. There's a, a bishop three player. This person is... So it goes like pawn one through nine, knight one through nine, nine being highest. And then it goes bishop one through nine. So that's actually the, the highest I've seen in this lobby. Like in the this lobby system. You just I'm gonna throw that on you. We oh that's the other thing. Look at that. We got ourselves a uh, <laughs> a lovely donkey wizard man. Okay, so I think that a good rule of thumb is to go if you're going <laughs> with axe, you should probably also get juggernaut because there is a orc benefit of getting 250 health up, which is quite a bit, especially this early on. Also, Warrior is, if you get three of them, their armor's increased by seven. So we're already, like, we're two-thirds of the way to Warrior, and we've already got uh, one for the Orc. So Axe will taunt everybody, make them attack him, and he gets a bunch of armor with his special. Juggernaut just does an AoE that makes him immune to magic. So it's pretty handy. I think that we will throw the Morbid Mask on you, and then we will just have a whole bunch of life regen. I'm assuming they... Oh, wait, it was a different thing. Totally wrong. Alright. So there we go. Just like that, we do have our warrior synergy up and going as well. Three warriors. He's sitting here alone. He does. We're not going to activate this beast or human thing. Uh, I think there's a, there's a couple units that we could look for a beast. There's like Tusk is a beast and a warrior. Whoops. Who's not a bad unit. That might be something up our alley. But after this, we should see if there's hopefully something for one we can get. I don't know how much gold we get after this turn, actually. Oh, we only get five. Okay. All right, so I think I'm going to go ahead and just hold on to the attack things for right now. I don't really know what I want. Lycan, at he uh, when he gets 100 mana, he turns into a lupine form. He gets extra, extra HP, and he also summons two little units that go along with him. All right, so we can't level up. Usually, I like to level up here at this level, like after round four, because it's really cheap to do so. But I don't see anything here. I don't want to sell this and I just, whatever. We'll roll with it. And I'm going to wait. If we lose this first one, we lose this first one. It's the only thing that will really be wounded will be our ego. Uh, it won't be that big of a deal. Okay, so we're going against somebody who didn't go for level ups anyways. We'll see what's better. He's got the three warriors, but I got three warriors and three orcs, or two orcs, so. In theory, we should have this on lockdown. We have quite a bit more going for us than he has going for him. Good deal. And these actually, I think they count as extra damage if we win. I wonder who we're fighting. We fought Slim Jesus. We beat him only by a little bit, but our wolf does count as a, as a unit as well. Okay. We are just about at the maximum orc synergy, which is four. The other unit is going to be a little bit harder to get. So what? Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Is there a beast? There is a beast. Let's go with Enchantress. Enchanted, I'm sure. Enchantress. And I'll keep that for later because uh, we got the three warrior. We're not going to get the six warriors anytime soon, which is even more armor. But we can activate this beast one right here, which is just an extra 10% attack damage on everybody. Also, it gives us a nice ranged unit. Who knows? Maybe that'll be beneficial for us. I'm starting to feel pretty good about this. 
One thing is, I don't know if Bladestorm gets any extra damage based off of... Uh, based off of items. I'm assuming no, to be honest. Who are we going against? Is that us? Oh, I hope that's not... Nope, that's not us. We beat... Oh, we beat Mr. Sith. By a lot. Oh my god, Mr. Sith. I'm sorry. Oh boy. Alright. So, something we could do that's kind of cute. Druid's thing is that if you have multiple druids, it makes them cheaper to upgrade. So we can just do something like that real quick. We get a pretty good value from it, to be honest. And we just, all of a sudden, we've got ourselves an upgraded Enchantress for the price of, uh, you know, two Enchantress. Because we get our money back for selling that tree ant guy. And if we won really handily with our build like it was, we should win pretty decently with the upgraded Enchantress as well. She has the added benefit of having, like, a heal. Oh! Okay, I thought this was going to be close, but no, never mind. Yeah, I'm not sure where I want to throw my items, but it's so far it hasn't mattered. We beat Smother really handily. Things are going quite well for old Rito. I'm very tempted by this Shadow Fiend. Very tempted by this Tusk. We could replace the Enchantress, but I just, I don't know that I want to necessarily, you know? Enchant? The dusk is always ready for a fight. Oh, last second. <laughs> last second, okay. I kind of just threw him out there because I knew I wanted to level up. All right, so we got a lot more units than he, uh, got, no, a little bit more. But his are pretty upgraded, aren't they? No, just a level two Enchantress and a level two Puck. Which I've got fairly comparable things. No, he's going to kick my rump. He's going to kick my rump quite hard. Did my lichen? My lichen didn't get his thing off. Oh. Okay. We are all good. Mr. Sith, you done, son. That was pretty close. You can actually put your items on units in the middle of fights. One of the weird... Things that you can kind of do on the fly. All right. Here's the question. Should I... Probably temporarily invest... I think we should temporarily invest ourselves in... That is a really tempting early Dragonite. That unit can be so dang strong... But we don't have a lot of... It's just not within the realm of what we're currently looking at. But there's a decent amount of other units... Or other people going for similar units here. I don't really want... I'm not going to... Enchantress is not in my long-term strategy. She just seemed like a, a quick, quick unit to get... You know, a two-piece out there. I'm so tempted to get this. I'm going to buy it, and I'll sell it if I next turn if I don't want to. We m might lose a gold on that unit. I'm not sure. That one, I don't quite know. Action hand. All right, here's the question. Are we going for it? You know, I don't know that I see full warrior as our trajectory. So maybe maybe we try to go for dragons and orcs. The only person going for dragons is that one has puck. Let's do that. Let's try for that. Let's bank on this really early. Uh-oh. This doesn't look great, I'll admit. Okay, wow, wow, wow. <laughs> the Beastmaster 
He throws out his axes and they do damage. Obviously, you saw that there. But they also increase the damage they take. And they kind of just blew up. All right, so we kind of want to... Eh, we want to just sit on our money as long as we are doing well. So I think I'm going to sit here and pick up dragons. And that's it. I'm not going to re-roll for anything. If we get dragons or uh, our units we already have, you know, that we want to upgrade. That's, that's all we'll do. I think we'll probably... There's way too many people going for Enchantress, aren't there? Aren't there? One. Kinda two. Very likely three that he's gonna want Enchantress as well. Because th that's a bunch of druids that'll just go well with it. I don't know. I'd like an upgraded Lycan. That'd be nice. Another Morbid Mask. Hmm. Okay. No dragons. No buying. No. Say no. We, okay, I'm kind of thinking we push to level 7, so that we can have 7 units out in 2 turns? Right? Wait. Yeah, that would make it so we could buy twice. But we'll push, I think we'll do that. I mean, unless we seem like we're going to start losing our win streak. So far, so fine, though. This looks pretty grim. If we're going to lose the, the streak, I think, uh... Oh, that was a pretty bad axe throw. I think we'll be okay, but it's really looking grim. Ah, man. I don't know anymore. Those wolves are so dang strong. Okay, we're going to be fine. I thought. So I thought. Maybe not. Wow. This is... We're going to be okay. But dang if it was not way too close for my liking. Did we beat anybody? We lost to Slim Jesus. Okay, so. Maybe we modify our plan just to make sure we stay. Oh. I don't like that, but I mean, it's not like that experience is going to go to waste, per se. I don't know. Dragonite is good because of his special form, but if you get the dragon synergy, which is all three of them out, he's basically, he starts out already in dragon form, effectively, which is a pretty big deal. And I thought that maybe just throwing that guy... I think... Because he's good, too. He... What does he do? He slows their attack speed and uh, does poison damage over time. So, we beat Joey. I don't know what that really means for us. He got beat by this person. Oh, This person beat me pretty handily. See, that's the thing. Now, we, we see this over here in the kill feed. We know that we are... We are not... Not so safe. Not so safe. So maybe we do dig a little bit, which I just, I'd rather not. Doom is a demon warrior. I think that's actually going to be more beneficial for us. Because that way we can, maybe it would be a, a little bit more flexible with our... Our warrior synergy. Maybe we can take somebody out. We are looking for a disruptor, which is the final orc for this. They are a purple name one, so they're going to be... Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. This is close. This is close. Doom is putting in a lot of work, though. And we're going to lose our streak. That's that. Just like that, the mighty's falling. 
Ouch. All right. I mean, we could transition either into <laughs> into a losing streak and just try to barely lose. But the thing is, there's some people down here that we will probably still beat. So I don't know that we can really. We're kind of in a in a rough spot with that. We want that. All right. So we we can go down to ten. It's okay. Goblin Warlock. Oh, there's Disruptor. We'll take it. Yeah, we actually kind of want to... No, we don't really... I don't know. Do we want to win or not? It looks like we... We won't, so. I mean, we don't want to lose health, obviously, but the fact of the matter is, whatever you are doing, you want to do it consistently until you're ready to push for victory. If you win, you need to make sure you do really well with your eco, your economy, which is keeping up your money, effectively. And if you're losing, you need to make sure that you, are, like, when you decide to pop off, you are going to pop off. Okay, so do we have an... We don't have an extra beast. Right now, I sort of have to... Do this. As soon as we get the next... Lot out, we can throw out the... Dragon Synergy, which will be nice. Because there's only three. But, so that should, that bumped up the health of all of the orcs, and we can do that little AoE silence there. Can we, please tell me we get this, just fine. Alright, that's a lot, that's a lot of HP, HP regeneration, mon frere. All right. So the big question. Do we care about Beastmaster anymore? We might not, to be honest. We have one, one, two, three, four. Let's just sell them. Honestly, we're getting nothing out of them. Who could we take? We would have to take away Doom if we wanted to have the Orc and... Oh, man. We can sell that. Get our money back for it. Alright. I don't love... I don't love this exact situation we're in right now, but I think we'll be able to pivot pretty soon here. Ooh, we got thrown away. This is looking less than stellar. Oh, you know what? Bada bing, bada boom, we're good. See, that's the thing. As soon as he turns into that dragon, he's awesome. He's really good. But it takes a little while to get there. And hopefully nobody else is going for Dragonite, because that'll make him really hard to get. Okay. Who? Oh. I think it'll be worth it. Good. Push for the victory. I think. Right? Push for wind streaking. I think so. Probably. So now he's going to immediately turn into a dragon, which will do uh, corrosive poison damage. It's just damage over time. Uh, Puck will be able to use this illusory ore, which is just like a big burst damage. And Viper will be able to immediately do a poison attack. But the big ticket there is the, the Dragon Knight. If we can get him to level 2, that's really where things are going to spike for us. That's going to be a big deal. Because that when he, that's when his attacks turn into AoE. I mean, you can see right there. We were getting kind of picked off by, by Slim Jesus before. And now he just fully terminated his streak there. Oh, no. 
that was somebody else. I thought we got matched into him as well. But we terminated this guy, which he gave me issues before. So you can tell that that was a pretty big power spike. Which is quite exciting. If we can swing it, we might be able to ride the momentum of that for a little while. We're level 8, and our pieces that I've got out are pretty valuable. Like, they've all, they're all serving a purpose. Doom completes the warrior synergy. Uh, Beastmaster completes the orc synergy. Disruptor 2. This will be an interesting one. They're kind of all spread out. Ah, uh, this doesn't look great, actually. He keeps on saying. And then that Disruptor ult comes out and it silences and deals damage to them. Does it still silence? Yes. Okay. As soon as that comes out, it seems like that's when things turn. Okay. I mean... Who was that? Schiffer... Schiffer Decker. Hopefully that's not a, <laughs> offensive. <laughs> but yeah, we're, we're beating Slim Jesus now by quite a bit. He's getting upgrades, though. He just got two big upgrades. Didn't he? Okay. So we've been beating him, but I don't know if we will still. Because he got two big upgrades. Um. Yeah, it's looking relatively fine. Definitely a lot closer than it's been. Ooh, okay. There's proof right there that he can slightly beat me. It does not always happen exactly the same way. But I think we can maybe play down to 20. Uh, we dropped Lycan. Disruptor. That's a good get. A level of three of him would be really nice. Oh, that was an accident. Uh-oh. All right. Well, we already played it, so let's go down to... Go down a little bit more. All right. An upgraded Juggernaut would be really helpful, too, because he, he scales pretty well. He stays good because he gets immune to... Uh, immune to magic damage, which is a pretty big deal when he's spinning. Tank damage up. Honestly, let's give all of our items probably to Dragon Knight now for when he turns AoE. Oh, I didn't even see this other Juggernaut over there. What the hell? I think that's a big enough upgrade to have us still sit at this point. Axe and Disruptor doing no damage. Beastmaster's not doing a lot either. Or at least he didn't there. Maybe that's just because he died right away. Viper's putting in some big work, apparently. Ah. Uh... It's hard to tell how some of these are gonna go. I think no, this one's this one's fine. This one's fine. All good. Back to the five win streak. Feels good to be back, baby. Feels good to be back. Beat Smother as well. Doom upgraded Doom would be big deal. Played a 20. Oh. Oh, that's worth it. Oh, that's that's a that's a big buy. Oh wait, what? Nope, 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 nope. Disruptor. 
Riding high. We can almost put him in our front line, to be honest. He's so beefy. Another Doom would be good. Take Puck. Because we're going to want to keep Puck. Because we're going to want to keep Dragonite. Oh my god. Oh! Big Disruptor! Big Disruptor all. This Queen of Pain, though, is really spooky, scary skeletons. Bad Disruptor all. <laughs> Who is that? That was Slim Jesus. Jesus. Slim Cheez Its. Schif Schiffer Decker. All these just feel like I'm just a fraction away from saying something offensive. Oh, he beat me, though. Man, are we going to be able to go for a level 3 Viper at this point? We could, probably, but I think I want to look for something else. A juggernaut. Not right this moment. Oh, it hurts, but... Oh, man. All right. Final dig. Done. Done. Bad. This guy's been... Yeah, he's got a lot of money. That's going to really backfire on us. Everybody's going for Dragon Knight now? Is that true? Going against Smother. Doesn't look too bad. Is it true that everybody is going for Dragonite? Yeah, there's a Dragonite there now? I went for Dragonite before it was cool. Is it, is it true? Because I, maybe I will change up my build. If he was so kind to say something. He's got Dragonite. He's only got one, though. I think he's being dramatic. One Dragonite. All right, he is being he is being dramatic. Okay. All right. So I will keep my my stuff as is. I think we're just gonna have to accept that we might possibly. Lose to, oh my god, lose to Slim Jesus and maybe to Schiffer Decker. I don't know. I have no idea about this person. Oh my god, they got a Techies who is going to explode and wreck everything. Wow, that is a problem. To say the least. That, that sucks. That unit is rough. You gotta kill it immediately. Because it, it's ultimate, it drops, <laughs> it drops a massive explosive bomb. Explosive. Still beats Smother. But I'm definitely on my way off of the throne here. I don't know. Everybody's going for corner strats. like that. Yeah, I <laughs> mean it's gonna turn out to be useless for this this fight right here, but it's gonna make me have to walk more. That axe has a lot of regeneration. And now I have a lot of stab wizard trees. Don't really know what to do with all that. I don't know if those stack. Should I go for Viper? I don't know. Oh, he's level nine. Ah, he's got. He just did so well with his economy, his eco, as they say in the biz. 
If I go for Viper, I almost feel like I want to sell this axe, though. It's it's one it's one gold. That means he it's effectively with the interest that makes him cost three gold instead of two. I think that's gonna be worth it. I really wish that silence came out just a little bit sooner. Things are going uh not so not so bad question mark. Alright. I've never been worried about Joey yet, so it's a little honestly it's a little sucky to see. Yeah, I'm getting bopped a bit. Getting bopped a bit. Alright, nothing I want. 22, I mean. Action hand. Give me that axe. Do we have a human? We do. Time to shove off. Mm -hmm. Kunkka will be our next piece, because he is a warrior for whatever that's worth, really. Oh my god. He's got a lot of scary stuff happening. He has a lot of scary stuff happening. He has no way we're going to come back from this, I don't think. Oh my god. Yeah, he's got it on lockdown, really. And I got beat by Slim Jesus as well. Honestly... This, uh, this is looking grim. Like, I will need to pivot pretty heavily. And that requires a lot of money. Or I could go for a losing streak. A level 3 disruptor seems unlikely. How much would it cost? Okay, so... 21... Oh, boy. Six buys. So we could do it. It just would take 30 gold. I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait. I will take the possible loss. We'll hold out until round 30. The next... Uh, Fight versus the environment. Oh my god, we're gonna get bopped. This dragon knight is not working how I want. Hmm. This is like... This is not entirely... I don't think druids are entirely sustainable. I could be wrong. but I mean, Lone Druid is amazing throughout the entire game. But, I mean... Oh. What would I have to pivot away from? Dragons? He's got the Dragonite level, too. Oh, yikes. Why do we have to get this guy again? Why do we have to get him again? That is awful. All right, and just like that, we are really falling from uh, falling from the heavens. Mister Sith's gonna take a hit. Joey's out. That sucks because I was uh, I was able to beat him. Enigma. I might want him. I don't really even remember what he. Oh. Action hand. Okay. That's really beneficial. What do you do, <laughs> even? Steeps an area in Dark Resonance, damaging enemies based on their max HP. That could be super beneficial. We would sort of have to... Eliminate something, or we could go... We could... Instead of Kunkka? We could go for Enigma? 
Oh, this is oh, this looks bad. Die to lizards. Otherwise, what? We drop orc synergy because Beastmaster is not gonna happen. Also, I couldn't go with it all the way up. All right, we'll we'll try that out. He's a legendary rank unit. Like maybe, maybe we can make something happen there. We're digging. Ooh, we're digging. Dwarf mech. It's a really good unit. Stupidly good unit. Like all the legendaries are stupidly good units standalone. Come on, Enigma. I want to see what you do. Hey, it's, it's not enough to save me, I'll tell you that much. We are absolutely on our way out. Hopefully everybody else is, like, more on their way out. But I am, uh... Ooh, I'm getting bopped. Finally, the, the rank two beaks master. So a little bit too late. I think maybe we go back to spread out strats. Holy crap! Look at everybody else getting beneficial things happening for them right now. You can sell that. That's not happening anymore. That, we're gonna dip out on that. We are looking for legendary units now, I'd say. Oh, God. Then you throw this in my face. That might be possible. Alright, okay, we can still hold our own against Mr. Sith, to an extent. Maybe... Can get him. Maybe. Maybe. Just because Axe is so beefy. No, ain't happening. That sucks. Wow, a lot of people got knocked out there. <laughs> we need something real big. We need another gyrocopter or something. In fact, let me just get that like that. It's not happening anymore. We only have a rank one doom right now. What am I? What am I doing there? There's a th oh, we got a level two gyrocopter. That's something. That's so something. Is that look at that damage? That's unreasonably high damage. Taking a big hit. Not dead. Oh my god. Schiffer Decker took a big hit. Gyrocopter does not get two hits off, I don't think. I think that's just something that don't happen. Techies. Just gotta try. Like, I don't know. I don't know. That was probably stupid. That kills our, uh, it does kill our synergy. We should have taken out Doom. Doom is completely useless right now. Okay, we get that big explosion. We get that big explosion. That looks really nice. I mean, is it gonna save us? No. No. Oh, it will, though. Somehow, it will. Alright, uh, oh my god. Like, alright. Doom's dead with, dead to me. Dead with me. <laughs> and there's my freaking third Doom. Still, like, 
This ain't happening. I just want to I want to place higher. That's that's all I'm looking for now. I just I want to die a little bit less. Oh, we're fighting the dragon. And honestly, we are going to die to him. We're going to die to this dragon. I'm pretty darn sure. Cuz our build was not very not very environmental friendly. That's a sad way to go. Sad way to go. <laughs> uh but we didn't really have anything on the bench that would have made that big of a difference. So, yeah, that's all right. You you don't win them all, and I I didn't think I was going to. Like this guy was creeping up on me here. Two of these are our bishop players here. I don't know if I want to stick around too too much to see who wins here. I'm a little curious. It probably will only be at turn or so. We can we can analyze what's going on here. Schiffer Decker has let's see. Mech. He's got mech, warlock, beast, everything. A lot of the times in the late game like this, people sort of drop their builds in favor of um, some really strong legendary units. Smother is out. And this guy, the Bishop 3 player, is bringing it back. I mean, it's, the top right here is in or order of rank. Like, if he wins. So what's he got? He's got the three Demon Knights now. Interesting, interesting build. Throwing the Enigma right there, too. Steep's area in Dark Presence. So he wants that out of the way right away. He puts that unit right there because that's the move he wants off immediately. Which is in interesting. Man, this is a mess. It looks pretty close, though. Like... No matter what happens, it's not gonna lose very much. If he even lost, oh yeah, he, oop. He's one one loss like that away from being totally out. This is kind of back and forth. I don't know. I wonder if this is a good idea. So he's putting this here to counteract something over here. What is he? What is he afraid of over here? Gyrocopter? Hmm. I definitely didn't manage around my board as much as I could have. But it's like, it's hard when it when your opponent is going to be random, you know? When it gets down to this, you can build accordingly. So he's trying to, he put those on the sides, I think, to keep them in the same space so Enigma can do a lot of AoE damage. Which really, really worked. Oh my god, did it work. If that was the strategy, it was really smart. Because they were down here, like, on the bottom before. He wasn't able to, like, keep them all in a circle so this ultimate would get them all. And he's got Reaver, which is a huge item. Like, your items can combine into other items. Um but I don't even know what this comes from. Part of the Tarrasque. You can even make something else. But, yeah. I, no, more power. Did, like, smart. He got the alt off again, but it looks like he's going to die right away. I don't know if that didn't seem to matter much. For the ultimate, at least. This is really going back and forth. Schiffer Decker's going to take damage here. And it could do it to him. Oh, my God. That's wild. That is wild. Anyway, that's going to do it for today. <laughs> Hopefully, you guys are uh, liking this. I'm just, it's a, like I said, it's probably just going to be a mini series unless a lot of people really are into it. But it's a warm-up, really, for 
the throwdown that's coming in a little bit, a couple days. Check it out on my channel. It's going to be a lot of fun. But that's going to do it for today. Thank you for watching. Thank you. Thank you. See you next time.